So I'm gonna do this quick tutorial if you guys want to know how to make like this animation like Dave from Capuchin. So basically what you want to do, you want to make your model like Dave. I made this little thing right here. It's for my game, Game and Dimensions. It's not out yet, but it'll be out in like a couple months, I guess. So like as you can see, we got like a little thing going on. Like there's like his flesh is popping out on his head, but it doesn't really matter. So after you have your model, what you want to type in is mix. Uh, mo and then it'll show this little thing right here there'll be a couple of videos down here but i want you to click on this little website right here now it'll load in something like a character like it'll load in something like this but i already have a model imported but if you want to import a model i'm going to show you how okay so one thing i forgot to mention is that you have to sign in first when you go to the website because it'll sign you out after 24 hours so basically just sign in then with your adobe account and then it should just connect you to the website where you can browse the animations okay goodbye so you want to search up like running crawl okay that's what it's called and then boom this animation should show up now as you can see it's running it's playing the animation, but it's running out of the frame. So you just wanna click this option called in place, and then it'll just stay right there. It's a lot better. Now, if you're doing this correctly and you haven't put, imported a model yet, you should see this like pink character robot, whatever. And then if you just wanna change it, you wanna click on upload character. Now, before you even now, before you even do that, make sure you export your model without a rig. So the Mixamo can rig the model correctly. So if you already have a rig, just delete it and then boom, it'll work. So then you want to export it without the rig. I already did that. So now you want to go back to Mixamo. Then you want to, it'll, then you want to click on upload character. It should ask you select character file or drop character file here. I'm just going to open up the thing so i'm gonna click on this i named it hello little <laughs> so after you clicked on your model that is not rigged yet you want to click on open and then it'll just process your, it'll just process your character and then it should load in the model now don't worry if it doesn't have textures when you import it to unity it'll already have its textures so you want to click next and then you can rig it so it'll show this little template right here so i'm just going to do that real quick so as you can see chin goes right here it also shows you like right up there i'll point an arrow to it it'll show like where you're actually placing it with a little close-up so i'll just do it i'll just do this real quick and make sure even if your character is a girl or a boy, make sure you have the groin. Or else this, or this part of the body, or the body won't even work. So, then you just want to select the knees. And then, boom. Your model will be done, rigged. It will be finally rigged. Now, what you want to do, you want to click on next. Now, I'll say it should take you like two minutes. So, let's just wait a second. So now after it's loaded, it should show this little preview right here. So after it showed you the preview, you can see like your character is correctly rigged. Now after that, you want to just click on next. And then it will tell me this, but it won't tell you this. It will tell me this because I already have the character in there. But just if it shows you this, then just click do not show this warning next time. Then it should load in and then boom animation should be in now the thing is i'm kind of worried about like the the arms are kind of broken for my model they're too long but if you guys well after you've done your model correctly you want to click download now i'll show you all these settings just keep them all the same the click download so now what you want to do you want to open your unity project they just want to drag it into a folder you have i'm just going to drag it into my models folder i already have it in there so i'm just going to drag it to like an empty spot in my horror map 
So, and as you can see, if you already have your textures dragged in here, it should already put the textures onto the model. Now, but if we check around our thing, there's absolutely no animations. Like even if you click on the animation tab, which you gotta go to window, animation, and animation. Yeah, animation, or can just press control six. Now, see, you did something wrong. What you wanna do, you wanna open up the little thing with that option, and then you wanna click on the animation thing. Now what you wanna do, you wanna click on control D. So now it'll load, and then it will duplicate the animation, but now you can edit it. So now what you wanna do, you wanna click on loop, and then you want to drag back in the model but this time you want to drag the animation that you duplicated onto the Mixamo rig rig hips and then it'll just load a second and then it'll put on an animator and then it'll tell you this but I think something went wrong Oh wait, I did something wrong. You want to drag it onto this, and then it should actually. Yep, now it works. So if we press play, our model now moves. So now you guys can set up pathfinding. Now you guys can set up the monster yourself. I'll link a little tutorial on how to do it because I really like using Shrek's tutorial, like the guy that made Big Scary. But yeah, if you, if you guys enjoyed this tutorial, please leave a like and subscribe because it'll really help me. And if you guys want to subscribe to my main channel, you guys can. So yeah. Goodbye.